All right, members, this week, instead of a uh, instructional video on swing and all that, I wanted to talk to you a little bit. Over the past few weeks, you've seen a lot of information about wedges and, and proper wedge fitting in our emails, and wanted to just talk about that a little bit. Here I have the new Callaway Mac Daddy 3 wedges. We've got three 60 degree wedges with different grinds and different bounces. And uh, I constantly get the uh, question from members, you know, uh, a 10 to 15 to 20 handicap saying, you know, what does it matter, wedges and all that bounce and, and things like that. And, you know, I'm not good enough to play maybe this certain bounce or this certain wedge or something. But what I want to talk to you about is the wedges and the bounces that people are using on tour are certainly something that can come into play and help you in your bag. For example, here I have three different 60 degree wedges ranging from an 8 to degrees of bounce and 11 degrees of bounce. The bounce angle is basically this angle here from the leading edge going back towards that. So the more bounce, the more likely that club is to come in and hit the bottom of that club and bounce back out. It's used a lot in bunkers, but also used around the greens and stuff. So for us, if you're a player that digs into the ground quite a bit, so really comes in steep and digs into the ground, we're going to want to fit you into a little bit higher bounce. So it may be a 60 degree wedge with 11 degrees of bounce. That's going to help when you come in steep to get that bounce will activate on the ground and bounce you back out of that shot so you don't stick the club in the ground too much. If you're a player that tends to pick the ball off the grass and doesn't take very many divots, you're going to want a club that doesn't have as much bounce because you don't want it to go through that grass quite as, as quickly. So when you come in, if you're more of a sweep type player that's picking that ball off the ground, you're going to want to stick with that 8 degrees of bounce. We have a lot of uh, demo wedges that you can try. My suggestion though is to, trade, to take one of the golf professionals out and help you decide whether you're somebody that swings very steep at the ball or somebody that sweeps the ball and see whether a new wedge might help your game or getting you into the right bounce, how it will help your game out of a bunker, out of short shots around the greens, and even on your 50, 60 yard shots from in the fairway. 